Hi, I'm Bart Polson, and I'm teaching this online course, and I thought it might be a really good idea for me to actually introduce myself, since during most of the course, you don't see me, you see my computer screen, and you hear my voice, but don't necessarily know who that's connected with. A couple of things to know about me. Number one, I am a psychology professor. Now, not the useful kind of psychologist like a clinical psychologist. I have a PhD in social and personality psychology. I have a background on doing experimental research to understand the way people think about people, about themselves. I did research on interpersonal conflict. I got trained as a mediator, did more research on that. That's my background. At least that's my background in psychology because I've done a lot more than that. So for instance, my whole life from the time I was a tiny little kid until I was a junior in college, I meant to be a designer. I was taking drawing classes and color theory and two and three dimensional design. And I loved it, but I did an internship, an informal internship at General Motors, which served the important purpose of internships to tell me what I did not want to do. And so I decided to switch over to psychology. After working around with a few different people and looking to see what I could do, I actually got connected with a professor at my undergraduate school. I went to Brigham Young University who was a social psychologist and doing fascinating research on the emotional division of labor in same-sex couples. It was such cool research. I decided I wanted to be a social psychologist too. So that's what I did in grad school. I went to the City University of New York. And while I was there, I got a Master of Arts and a Master of Philosophy and a PhD in social psychology. I then came back to Utah. I got married while I was in school and my wife, Jackie, who is a modern dance choreographer, is from Salt Lake. So even though I'm from Los Angeles, we came to Salt Lake so she could resume her career. She had a lot of things going on here. And I started teaching part-time at Salt Lake Community College, at Utah Valley State College, as it was known then. Then I got a full-time gig for th three years at BYU as a visiting professor. When that wrapped up, a job miraculously opened at UVU and I applied for it and have been here now for 18 or 19 years. And I love it. I love what I'm able to do here because not only do I get to teach statistics and I've actually taught a whole range of psychology classes, introductory psychology, lifespan, social, personality, gender, sexuality, test and measures, cognitive, experimental research methods. Uh, and, and of course, a lot of sections of statistics, there's things going on there. I've actually also been able to do creative work. You see, I used to be a design student, like I said, but I haven't totally given that up. I, for instance, got to go on a sabbatical a few years ago to learn more about data visualization. That's an important element of working with data. And I enrolled for a year again as a full-time undergraduate student at the U of U and got an arts technology certificate. During that time, I also learned how to do some creative work. I put a Microsoft Connect onto my Mac, and I got a bunch of dancers to do improvs, and I did some computer processing on that and turned it into a big three-projector piece that I showed in the gallery. After that, I actually got to collaborate with my wife, the choreographer, to do some digital work and choreography for Repertory Dance Theater in Salt Lake. And then here at UVU, I collaborated with both my wife and with Nicole Ortega of the dance department on a two-year project we called Dance Loops, where I designed methods for doing live video manipulation and looping for modern dance on stage. It's a lot of fun. And the important thing about that is it all came about because of my interest in statistics. It's not just this, you know, right brain, left brain sort of thing. My creative work is connected and really springs from a lot of my own work in psychology. And so, I have a lot of interests. I do statistics, I do data science, I do creative work. I also teach people how to work with a lot of things, both in classes here at UVU and online. I make video courses for LinkedIn and I do things like explain what data science is, what data mining is, what big data is, and show people how to use programs like R and SPSS and Jamovi and I have my own company called datalab.cc where I also make video courses that I give away for free. And all of this connects 
circuitously with my interest in both statistics and in data science. Anyhow, these are some of the things that are important to me and have motivated some of my work. And truthfully, my hope is that I can find a way to help you do the things that are important to you. If you're thinking about graduate school, I would love to talk with you about that. If you're thinking about changing majors, I would love to talk with you about that. If you're thinking of opening a business, I would love to talk with you about that and see how I can possibly give you some useful information from my own experience and from the time that I've spent as a, both a professor and as a person to help give you some suggestions that might be useful in all of those. In any case, please reach out, please contact me. I would love to hear from you. And in the meantime, thanks so much for joining me here.